Hello, welcome to this practice problem from algebratesthelper.com. And what we're going to do here is graph this line. Okay, so we have what we call a linear equation, or if you kind of think about the way that sounds, a linear equation sounds like a line equation, and that's exactly what this is. So this is the equation of a line, and what we want to do here is graph it. All right, so this line is what we call, it's written in a, a form called the slope-intercept form. Okay, right here, this number is the slope, okay, the number in front of the x, and then this number over here is the y-intercept. So anytime a, a line is written where it's y equals m x plus b, and m once again is the number in front of the x, and b is this other number, in this case it's just 3, this is a line in slope-intercept form. So to graph a line in slope-intercept form, I'm going to erase this here, what we do is we start with this point here. This is this point is the is the um, coordinate where the line is going to intersect the y-axis. So this is going to be three. So I'm going to go up to three on my y-axis here. One, two, three. So this is one point that's on that line. Okay. Now what we do is we use the slope information. In this case, it's one half as kind of a set of um, directions to get to our second point. So if you think about it, you need two points to graph a line, okay? So from this point here, I'm going to use this one-half to tell me how to get to the next point, okay? So the one-half is our slope, and that indicates the rise over the run, okay? So the one is how much the line rises, and the two is how much the line runs. And the way this works is the following, okay? This line is is rising up one for every two it runs out to the right. So using that slope information, I, what I need to do is go up one, okay, I need to go up one, and then over two to the right. So from this point three, that I plotted right here, I'm gonna go up one, and then over two to the right. Okay, so see what I did here? I went up one and over two to the right. That's my driving directions to my second point, and that's my second point right there, okay? Now, of course, I'm not using or very technical language. I'm using driving directions, etc. But I, you know, I'm trying to get you to understand how to graph lines, you know, uh, in an easy to understand manner. Okay. So we have this coordinate three. Okay. Then we use the slope one half to get to the second coordinate. And now I have two points that are on this line, and I can just go ahead and draw a line through it. So this is the graph of the line y equals. Let's go ahead and draw here. Y equals one half x plus three. So I'm going to be doing a lot more examples of graphing lines. It's a common place where students uh, sometimes have trouble in, in algebra. So subscribe to my YouTube channel and come on over to algebratesthelper.com. I have a ton of free notes that you can access if you're learning um, algebra. Excellent resource. Okay, have a great day.